Hey guys, how you doing? So today I am making a roasted vegetable sandwich. So I am using some of these veggies that I had in my fridge. We got some bell pepper, tomato, zucchini, eggplant, loaf of ciabatta bread, uh, cut hill ricotta. This is a really good vegan pesto from Trader Joe's. We're gonna use this as a spread on our bread. So we're gonna start by slicing up some of these veggies. You wanna slice all your veggies pretty thin because you're gonna throw these into the oven and you want them to kind of grill and cook relatively quickly. Same thing with the zucchini. You're gonna slice these up about, I'd say half an inch of thickness. Cut your uh, bell peppers down to uh, kind of like thicker, chunkier slices. You don't want to cut these too thin. I'd probably say about mm, two inches of thickness. They look like this. Slice up our tomato. We're gonna slice these up into about an inch in thickness. You don't want them too, too thin. generous portion of olive oil. Pepper. Garlic powder. Give all your veggies a little toss. You can even flip them over and see them on the other side if it's like the zucchini and the uh, eggplants. So I have this really nice rustic ciabatta bread that I got at uh, Whole Foods. So we're gonna cut this into our sandwich size slices. So I got my veggies out of the oven. These were in the oven at 450 for about 15 minutes. I would check on them periodically just to make sure that they don't burn, but anywhere between 15 to 20 minutes is, is where you want them to be. So we're gonna build our sandwiches now. I am going to start with my Kite Hill Ricotta. We're gonna take a little bit of the Kite Hill Ricotta. And we're gonna spread it on the ciabatta bread. I'm gonna add a little tiny bit of salt and pepper. Pesto sauce, top and bottom. I have this cheese that I got from a little local cheese place uh, here in LA. It's called Gourmage. He makes amazing cheeses. This is his uh, vegan pepper jack. So I'm gonna take a little slice of this and I'm gonna lay them inside. Feel free to add it onto your sandwiches. Um, if not, the ricotta is, in, is plenty. I mean, that alone is a great little addition to the sandwich. I just really love his cheese, so I'm gonna add some of the cheese onto the bottom of our sandwich. Now I'm going to layer in our eggplant. into the oven, two minutes at most, just to kind of melt the cheese down, warm up and crisp up the bread. And there you have it, roasted vegetable sandwich. 